What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of All Fishing TV. Today I am bringing back the $25 challenge. For all you guys that have been subscribed to my channel for a little while now, last year I did the $25 challenge and pretty much what that is, long story short, uh, I go to the store once a week, buy $25 worth of tackle of a certain type of bait and I stock up that way. So I'm slowly working my arsenal up and by the time spring comes, I will be fully stocked. And I think this is just the best way because I'm only spending 25 bucks a week. I'm not not breaking the bank I'm not emptying my wallet this price works for me and I, I'm able to do it every single week it pretty much just makes it so you don't have to go to the store and spend like 400 bucks on baits and stuff to get stocked up over the springtime and and pretty much the rest of the year so that was a quick rundown of what the $25 tackle challenge is and now we are heading out to the store today we are going to Dick Sporting Goods uh, to start off this winter and to start off this challenge enough babbling let's go over to Dick Sporting Goods So as you can see, it's pouring out and there was snow on the ground. We actually got a pretty big snowstorm, not really huge, but snowstorm the other day. And now it's like just above the temperature where it's not snowing, but it's still, it's freezing cold rain. The fishing is pretty much done for the year, at least here in Connecticut. But don't worry guys, I am actually going with Megan to Florida early January. Definitely look forward to some fishing videos coming up very soon. I'm super pumped about it. And I have some other big news, huge freaking news. I'm not gonna tell you guys yet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the suspense a little bit just because if I'm gonna make a video on it I want to make that it's separate video um, but if not you guys will you guys will find out soon I promise you, you guys you guys will find out soon I am so freaking stoked I'm not gonna get any shots of me walking in so the next time you guys will see me I will be in Dick's Sporting Goods so there's one thing that I love using and I'm actually low on so I'm gonna focus this episode on spinner baits check this check this out really quick it's a triple blade spinner bait a Mike Iconelli bait what is it called? The Lover? <laughs> That's weird. Um, but yeah, it has three willow leaves on it, two medium sized one and two looks like a slightly bigger. But I think I'm gonna have to do this. This looks sick. Just about $12 and that is gonna start off our challenge. I'm also gonna stick with the black and blue. That is my favorite color spinnerbait to throw. It is good in any color water, so. I also think I'm gonna focus on quality over quantity this episode. I usually go for quantity, but I have so many cheap spinner baits that I really need to get some good ones. So next step, I'm gonna pick one of these Gary Yamamoto baits. They're going for $6. I have a bunch of white and a bunch of chartreuse in white, so I'm gonna go with a different kind of color here. I think I'm gonna go with this like sexy shad color, 3 8 ounce. Wow, that looks crazy. <laughs> I really trust the yeah, Gary Yamamoto bait, so definitely gonna pick this up. It's $6, I think. Yep, six bucks. This episode's actually going pretty quick. I'm already up to 18 bucks. I got seven bucks left. Not quite sure if I should go for one more bait or two. If I'm talking a little bit quieter, it's because I never get used to filming in public. It's still a little bit awkward, but you just gotta, you just gotta power through it. Gotta power through it. I think I'm gonna pick up two of these. Don't yell at me in the comments section because I'm going a tiny bit over, but they're $3.99, so I think I'm gonna go a buck over if my math is correct. Yes, four plus four is eight. I needed seven bucks left, so yes, I'm gonna go one dollar over before tax. But I'm gonna pick up one of these, and I'm also going to pick up this white one with uh, black like specks on it. Both of them have the silver blades. I don't know why I'm not focusing here. I'm gonna pick up both of these, but it's all right because I'm getting some quality baits here. Lunker Hunt is a good company. I, at least I think they are. And there we have it guys, a good handful of quality spinner baits. Good, how are you? Good. You got a scorecard with us? Uh, yes. The receipt is gonna lie to you guys. It says that I spent $60 
but that's only because I had to buy gloves too. So that doesn't count. So for new viewers, in every single $25 tackle challenge video, at the end of the video, I go over what I got, why I got it, somewhat, and how much it costed. So let's take out the first bait. So the first thing I decided on was this new Mike Iconelli bait. It is a spinner bait with three spoons on it. I'm actually gonna take this one out because I really want to show you. I want to get a closer look and I'm sure you guys want to get a little bit closer look too because this, I'm pretty sure this is brand new. I haven't, at least I haven't seen this out yet. So let me know if this is brand new or not or if I'm just being an idiot. But look at that guys, three blades on this spinner bait. That is freaking awesome. I've never seen anything like this before. Obviously you, there's the single blade and there's the double blade but I've never seen three blades. That is so cool. And obviously black and blue. Um, I love black and blue. I caught my personal best on black and blue. So now that bait went for $11.97. We're just gonna round it up to 12. Moving on. Next bait I picked was the Gary Yamamoto spinner bait. This is a sexy, sexy, sexy shad color. I'm gonna take this one out as well. I'm gonna make a mess of my truck as well in the process. Wow, that hurt. <laughs> that is a sticky hook. This is actually a pretty big spinner bait. Look at it compared to my hand. It's very wide. I mean, you can't beat this color. Sexy Shad is one of the best colors in the fishing game. This one went for $5.99, rounding that up to six. We are up to $18. Sadly, I only got four baits today, but that's what happens when you go for a little bit more expensive baits. But I ended up squeezing out two more baits by Lunker Hunt. Um, both spinner baits, obviously, is a spinner bait episode. First one I got was this frog colored one. I think this is actually super cool. This is legit a, uh, a frog pattern. Black dots, yellow and green, and a little bit of white on there. Just the chrome metallic blades. The second one I got was this white one, a little bit of black on the trim, same color blades, and these both went for, let me get the receipt really quick, $3.99 a piece. $12.18, $22.26. Dollars before tax, but I, I don't count tax. Anyways, so we went a dollar over, but we got four pretty good baits that I have pretty good confidence in, so I'm happy. Anyways, guys, I am going to sign off for now. I have a giveaway, if you guys didn't know, the video link will be in the description. Make sure you enter into that. Stay tuned for some huge news, guys. I, I swear, guys, this is some big news, I promise. This no fishing thing is getting old, but we have Florida coming up, and... Yeah, I'm pretty, you guys are pretty much filled in with everything going on right now. More videos coming out. I'm going to try to do these $25 challenges every week. I'm not sure if that's going to be possible, but I'm gonna try my best. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you guys on the next one.